Bordeaux have won only a single game in their last eight league and outings. And ahead of their French Cup quarterfinal in Lens on Wednesday, they welcome Montpellier to Stade Chaban del Mar. Well, the champions are still in the running for a European finish, but the uncertainty surrounding next season's coach has taken its toll. Since the announcement that René Giroud will be leaving the club this summer, they've picked up only four points in four games. And it didn't take long for Bordeaux to take a hold of the match. Ludovic Abraniak whipping in a free kick here in the sixth minute and Sheikh Diabati's header coming back off the post. Gregory Sertic then sent in a corner in the 11th minute and Ludovic Sané got up to head Bordeaux in front. The Franco Senegalese with his first goal of the season. Bordeaux doubled their lead in only the 24th minute. Nicola Morris Bullet got to this high ball ahead of Daniel Congre to play in Diabate. Well, he jinked this way and that before seeing his deflected shot, Lupo for Geoffrey Jordan for 2 0. And Montpellier is defending, leaving a little something to be desired here. Diabate getting the better of Abdul Hamid El Qatari and Vitorino Hilton before scooping in. René Girard looking a little concerned. Two minutes later, Bordeaux made it 3-0 with a superb counter-attack. Benoit Tremolinas was at the origin, slipping forward for Maurice Bully. He squared for Abraniak, who returned it to Tremolinas. Well, he simply had to come forward and pick out Yaroslav Plazil, who slotted in his second goal of the season. A delight for the home fans, who were no doubt pleasantly surprised. Bordeaux scoring as many goals in 26 minutes here as they had in their previous eight games. Into injury time at the end of the first half, and Montpellier finally managed to get a foothold in the match. Unsurprisingly, Remy Cabello was at the origin, picking up possession and playing a neat one-two with Suleiman Kamara. He then turned Julian Faubert inside out before firing past Cedric Carrasso. Cabela with his seventh of the campaign, but will he still be at Lamosson next season? Well, that was the last of the action in a busy first half. Bordeaux taking a 3-1 lead into the break. The away fans determined, of course, to enjoy themselves nonetheless. Well, with Francis Gillot calling for calm from the bench, Bordeaux came forward again in the 54th minute. Tremolinas played a superb 1-2 with the Braniac before pulling back for Henri Sivy, who wrong-footed Jordan to make it 4-1. Well, Bordeaux thrashed Lorient 4-0 away from home in November, but the last time they scored four goals at home was back in December 2009. The hosts rampant then, and the champions in disarray. Well, indeed, this chance for Montpellier in the 66th minute summed up their evening rather well. Cabela picked up the ball on the edge of the area and sent in a cross, only for Kamara and Anthony Munier to get in each other's way and allow Seve to clear the danger. Nice. Well, Montpellier did pick up a consolation goal in injury time as Jonas Martin crossed in from the left. Forbel's attempted clearance was headed back in by Benjamin Stambouli and Kamara ducked out of the way to let the ball trickle home. Well, Kamara at the limit of offside here, but the flag stayed down and it ended 4-2 to Bordeaux. Ideal preparation for the hosts then before their trip to Lens, while Montpellier will hope to bounce back at home to Lyon on Friday.